Hello, sweet souls. It's Friday, December 30th, and I wanted to come back on and give you guys a message. So, December 31st, tomorrow, is the closing out of 2022. And I want you to use that day to release anything from your past, any pain attached to the lesson, um, any memories or thoughts attached to the lesson, and I want you to focus on being in a highest vibration possible, celebrating blessings in your life, no matter how small or how big they are. Make the commitment to celebrate every single thing that's positive in your life. Only you have control over your mind and how you react to other people, how you respond to other people trying to disturb your peace. You have the power over your mind if the past comes to your mind moving forward into 2023, you can say, go away. I'm not thinking about you, go away. You have control, okay? Remember that. Um, for 2023, you know, they want you to be open to receiving blessings. They want you to be flexible about how the blessings come in, but they want you to be in the energy of receiving. Um, because when you do that, they want you to observe the changes that occur, okay? Um, the past karmic cycle is a wheel that will never stop. It's a cycle that will be never ending for you if you allow past people back in. And I don't care if it's ex-loves, family, friends, lower vibrational energies that you've already had to release. Um, they're saying they can't go into your new life. There is a group of people, a community of people that you cannot take with you into this new beginning. And in this new life, you are going to be your true authentic self, speaking your truth and <clears throat> unafraid of judgment of other people. It's going to lead to prosperity. It will. You have to be patient. You have to be in a high vibration and you have to be in a space of gratitude. Um, but your healing that you have done is bringing you into a higher vibration and you are calling into your reality, happiness, happiness. So don't let past memories um, haunt you, okay? You have power and control over that. You need to push forward and make that commitment um, to take control back over your mind and being in a positive place, okay? Um, what I would do for tomorrow night is write down every person, place, or thing that you wish to be released from you energetically, spiritually, physically. Write every single person's name and who you're releasing. At the bottom of that, um, I would write everything that you are grateful for that you are manifesting as if they've already given it to you. And then I would burn it. Go outside and burn it. Or if you have a fireplace, and burn it. I would do that for December 31st. Going into the new year, making that commitment to yourself and to the, the divine that you are willing to put in the effort to release what doesn't serve you and to be open to receive the blessings that they have for you. Okay, guys. So this is a message that I have for you. I love you. I hope you guys have uh, an amazing day. Bye-bye.